Welcome to the channel. This video is going to go over the fastest way to buy Ripple XRP. I've had a lot of questions from my older video, which is not the best quality, but it's got a lot of views. So this video is a new updated process. If you want to buy Ripple, um, there's a faster way to do it. And I'm going to show you how in this video. So let's get into it. What you need to do first is you're going to need some Bitcoin. You need to figure out how you want to buy the Ripple. I would suggest Coinbase. If you have a Coinbase account with Ethereum, Litecoin, or Bitcoin, you're going to need some of that currency, cryptocurrency, in order to get the, the Ripple because we're going to use a, an exchange from the Exodus wallet that will allow you to exchange one of those cryptocurrencies to Ripple. And it's easier than using Kraken like the older video showed. Um, this is a newer method that is really easy, actually. So it's a little um, advanced but really it's not complicated. Um, this is an unreleased wallet by Exodus. Exodus is a really popular cryptocurrency wallet. A lot of people's favorite. I like it. This is an advanced version of it. They call it Eden. It's unsupported for advanced users, they say, but it's been working well. It's not really buggy. It's really solid. It works great. And the good thing about it has a lot of other cryptocurrencies that the normal Exodus doesn't have. So the advantage of using this one is you get to exchange between a lot of other cryptocurrencies, which is very cool. So there's a list of all the cryptocurrencies they have on here right now. And the one we're interested in is Ripple right here, XRP. So this is one of the fastest ways to purchase Ripple. So you got to come to Exodus Eden. I'll put the link in the description. So this page says right here, it says this page on our website is purposefully hidden. Do not share this with your new friends as I will likely get stuck doing tech support. But I don't think you're a noob. If you're watching videos like this on YouTube, you're a little bit above the noob level. So, and don't be scared. That's just, it's kind of funny. They just, they're just saying they're not gonna support you with this software. But if you have used Exodus, this is pretty much the same. So come here, link in the description, download the one for your operating system. They got Linux mac and windows download the version that you want and then once you install it open it up on your computer it's going to open up into a window like this this is a demo version that i have set up so i can show you what it looks like when you first install this and if it is your first time it's going to ask you if you want to insert or restore from a backup so if you have a backed up version of exodus you can use your key and import it into here and have all the cryptocurrencies that you would have on the old exodus so anyways you come here and you're going to go to wallet and if you want to use bitcoin or you can use litecoin you're going to go from coinbase or wherever you have your other cryptocurrency you have to send some to this wallet so whatever one it is you click receive it's going to give you the address use this address as your receiving address that you're going to send your cryptocurrency to and then you're going to use that to purchase ripple um, as you can see it's not on the list here so what you need to do is go to add more at the bottom scroll through the list and here is ripple click that come back to wallet and you'll see ripples here now and we have zero ripple and what you do is go to exchange over here on the left and then we have Bitcoin. You have the whole list here. This will be what is in your wallet and they'll have the balances here. So say if you have Bitcoin, you want to use Bitcoin to buy some Ripple. Oh, it's already selected. Then you come over here and you put Ripple on the right. It says Ripple is temporarily available. So this that is one thing that's kind of frustrating about this process. Kind of glad it showed that because Usually when the network is busy and you really want to do some exchanging, a lot of times it'll say temporarily unavailable. You would select Ripple. I'm going to do Zcash as that's not temporarily available. You select it and then you just do the amount you want to exchange over here. You can enter the amount of Bitcoin or you can enter the amount in US dollars. And then it'll tell you how much you're going to get in that cryptocurrency. And then once you are fine with the percentage, and then you down here, you click the exchange button. So right now it's telling me I don't have enough Bitcoin in this exchange. This is a demo wallet and that's why I don't have enough. 
but that's how you work and then once you click exchange it's gonna go through and once it gets verified the transactions get confirmed in the network it'll show up in your wallet and boom you got ripple so it's much easier than the old kraken way kraken's really slow and you know this is much faster i think and then this wallet is a great wallet to use and you have the keys it's much safer than leaving it on kraken so this is definitely the way to go if you want to purchase some ripple in my opinion yeah i wish the ripple wasn't really unavailable so i could show you exactly but you get the picture i'm sure sometimes they're going to be unavailable and sometimes they'll have a little message down here <clears throat> that'll show you it'll be like a network um, information you click it, it'll be like a colored dot and it'll tell you what's going on with the network so sometimes it'll say something about the status so you come over here they're not saying anything about ripple at the moment but for instance bitcoin network is extremely congested over 200,000 unconfirmed transactions compared to the usual 20 to 40,000 so they will um the kind of disable trading which i think is really not cool i don't think they should control that anyway i think if you want to trade i think you should be allowed to trade but anyways that's that where did it go so yeah you can also do litecoin you can do any coin if you have ethereum you can come and exchange it for all these other tokens also if you have any questions post them in the comments other than that thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one peace It says this page on our website is per perp this because this is a, a, a